What is going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another exciting fishing adventure off the Texas coast. Welcome to the channel. My name is Nick. This is Arx Angler. So, uh, kind of starting a little bit late. I missed the sunrise. However, we got a hard, hard outgoing tide. So the plan is to hit up this marsh system that I've been doing pretty good for the past few times I've been out here. I know the water level is going to be a little bit lower since we had that hard push out from that tide. So I'm going to try to go back and hit the drains. Hit this one particular drain that I've had pretty good success with. I'm going to be using a bugs fishing lure because I feel like that's going to be the best lure to target these fish during the springtime when you're competing against all the hatch hatchlings and all the bait that's out there. It's going to be tough, but bugs will get the job done. I have faith in it. But anyways, guys, let's see if we can catch some fish. Super excited to be out here. If you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, hit that bell notification. Let's see if we can get you a good video. We're here to look for some redfish and flounder. Uh, man, kayak fishing can be tough sometimes, especially when you launch. <laughs> but we're here, man. Look at this. A little bit late from the sunrise, but it doesn't matter. We're here enjoying God's beautiful creation. Check this out, man. Beautiful. All right, we're going to be using the flats bug. As I stated in the intro, we'll be working drains shoreline looking for any type of blow up last time i was out here i did really really well the bait were was well, kind of moving i can say they're kind of not moving but today the conditions are kind of the same overcast a little bit cool bait fish not really moving anywhere so i'm just going to work this shoreline here hopefully i'll you know put some eyes on some pop-in shrimp or pop-in small baits and just looking down this drain right here i'm seeing good freaking wake movements way up there so that's a good sign oh that's that's a really good sign man that's a nice wake movement coming right towards me within this drain oh that's a redfish right there oh my gosh i can't believe early this morning it's happening dude that's a red right there okay where'd you go buddy where'd you go where'd you go where'd you go he's somewhere here it's a nice big one too i'm using the perfect lure the side cast redfish. Oh, there he is up there. There he is. He's going into that marsh. Don't go into that marsh, buddy. Come back out here and play with me. There's another big splash up there. Dude, did I hit the jackpot? Man, I don't wanna I don't wanna jinx this super early in the morning. I don't know what is wrong with my GoPro, but there's another redfish right here. He is right here, man. His tail coming out of the water right there. <laughs> wow. I hit the jackpot early in the morning, man. I'm telling you what. Even though, there we go. <laughs> I was going to say, even though I hit the jackpot, it doesn't do good if you don't catch them. <laughs> nice, nice, nice on the bugs. Love it, man, love it. That's a good fish, man. Man, I'm BFS. Good fish, good fish, good fish. Wow, he is a, he's a puller, man. Oh yeah, that's a good fish. Really good. Mid slaughter all day long. Maybe upper mid slot. 
Oh my gosh. You know they're big when they pull your kayak. Stop playing. <laughs> oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. All right, redfish number one. Caught this guy creeping on that grass line. Just working his tail out of the water. And he's a massive one, man. On the bugs, flats bug. Hopefully you can see in his mouth. That's a big fish, man. Oh, wow, probably 26 inches. <sighs> Pushing seven pounds, no doubt, man. He's an old guy, too. Got black markings all over him. I am Groot <laughs> on two sides. Look at that, man. First fish, all right, let's let him go. Catching a nice big redfish. Nice like that. All right. All right, hold on, hold on. Man, you got a lot of energy, don't you, buddy? All right, there we go. <laughs> All right, get the hell out of here. All right. Get out of here. Go find a mate. Go make some babies. Dang, you're a big fish, man. Yeah, upper mid slot for sure. Good God, you're big. There she goes. He goes. He's croaking. Well, one down. Two more to go. Bugs fishing lures, it works. All right, had success. Saw two redfish in this little drain marsh, which leads me to say possibly I might see another one come by. So I'm just gonna kind of patiently wait around, look for that wake. That was just too easy. I mean, they're here. There's no doubt about that. So yeah, that little drain, it kind of died down. I'll go back when I head back out. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna work this grass line. Not too far. Um, I mean, I can I can explore the drains, go deeper in, but kind of just wanna stick to the main bayou or river here because it seems like a lot of action or <laughs> potential action can happen in this river and there's a lot of depth and different undulations. So I'm just gonna kind of work my way, blind cast, kind of scan the sides here look for anything that mimics bait fish being blown up big hard wakes anything that piques my interest and I'll kind of attack it oh wow redfish right there dang you missed him spooked him so I decided to come into this marsh that I caught the first redfish in and well the second redfish I saw obviously and seeing a little bit more bait movement but it just kind of died down not sure what's going on here the water looks like it's draining pretty good too so I'm going to kind of blind cast this intersection here because I see ripples in the water but that's bait fish but that's that's what we're looking for yeah let's see if we can catch one more redfish Oh, that was a red right there. Here he comes, here he comes, here he comes. Here he comes, here he comes. Oh my gosh, Nick, you're an idiot. You might have missed your opportunity right here. He's like right here somewhere. So he's, they're here, man. I just saw one. Might be him up there. There it is. There he is. Up there. I think he swam back up there. But it's really shallow up there. I just saw his tail come up. Yep, he's right there, right in the shallow. I'll kind of creep on this side so I don't create such a wake. It's really shallow here. Oh, there's a red right there. He 
It's like right here. I saw him. There we go. We got him. We got you, buddy. There we go. That's a good redfish. That might be another one up there. Nice redfish. Oh, yeah. Good red. Good red. Thank you. For blown up. Oh, no. He dropped it. No. <laughs> well, that's sight casting for you sometimes. I think that's another one up there. Oh, we'll catch up to him. Oh, yeah. Another redfish right there. So, let's see if we can catch up to those guys. I see you. I see you. I don't see you no more. Yeah, there's a couple of them. I think I, I think I spooked them. There's, there's one right there. I mean, they're, they're really spooky. It's hard to get them to bite. Because I know they can feel me. And they probably can see me too. I mean, it's super shallow here. There's one right here too. <laughs> They're all right here. It's a mi mi mixture of bait and redfish. I just can't get them to bite. They're spooked. I see their tails out. <laughs> They're probably like, hey man, there's someone after us right now. Well, you know what? I'm just going to push them out. They don't want to cooperate. You know what? We're going to just push you out. <laughs> Look guys, I'm not going to eat you, right? Promise. Yeah, I'm Asian, but I'm not going to eat you. See, they're all here. Like right in front of me. They're all just being so spookish. Because I think I, spooked, I screwed it up. <laughs> There's like, probably like three or four of them here. Just hanging out in the shallows. Getting pushed out by this hard outgoing tide. <laughs> and there they are. <laughs> Yeah, that really sucked, man. Uh, you know, sometimes that's just the way it is. You try your best, and they're just really finicky. I'm thinking it's probably a mixture of me spooking one of them, two of them, and they're telling the whole group, hey, watch out, this this dude, this fat dude in a white kayak is coming to get us. And on top of that, there's a lot of bait there that they're munching on. So, you know, I am opportunities, missed it. Could have had two good fish on. It is what it is. Yeah, but super happy I got the time to come out here enjoy the Texas coast and the plan actually really worked I really you know during the intro I thought I was going to go get in the back marsh because the water level is gonna be low Perhaps I was going to see some redfish and that's that's what happened. So yeah, I love it when the plan comes to fruition There we go There we go. Yeah, that was the same guy I guess he kind of moved downward. I got him. So really happy. Being consistent works out. <laughs> Man, this would have been a limit. Well, first I can't talk too much crap. I gotta get him first. This would have been a limit of reds if I had a, if I got that second one while I was sight casting them earlier in the early marsh. We got you, fella. Oh, he's a nice fish. Nice fish. Perfect table fare type redfish, honestly. Oh yes, we got you, baby. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, I redeemed myself from that stupidity in the marsh. It's a nice table fare redfish right here, probably right at 21 inches. Got him on the bugs, saw him waking. I thought it was a big mullet, but then I kind of looked closely. The shrimp were popping like they were running for their lives. So it was this guy, I missed him. Then he kind of moved back down that way. And I kind of blind cast him. I got him to finally commit, man. Persistent work, hard work pays off. So this is number two today. Super happy to be able to make it a successful redfish day when I knew it's going to be tough battling against all that bait and that hard tide, outgoing tide. But we got it done, man. On the bugs. Super happy. Let's let them go. Well, not all is lost, man. Able to catch two redfish as I stated on the bugs. Pretty would have caught more if I wasn't so stupid and. Um, well, yeah, we'll, we'll say that for a different story for another time. But anyways, guys, let me go over my equipment real fast. A lot of you guys are new. Sorry, it's a little tingled here, but we got the old 18 suppressor BFS ultralight, the all the Baron 2022 BFS reel right here. Veribus 1.2 gauge rated line. And at the end, we have the flats bug, which did all the heavy lifting today. So if you're looking to purchase the rod, I have a 20% discount. Uh, in the description box below if you're looking to purchase the line 
I have the Veribus discount in the description box below. And linked is the bugs along with the trailer. If you're looking at, if you're interested in buying that, it's also in the description box below. But thank you guys so much. I love every single one of you. And we'll catch you guys on the next one.